Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to be going over the Final Edition John Beeson card, and just like all the Final Edition collections, he has four cards in his collection, and you get 5,000 coins when you complete it, and I assume also a Lombardi pack. First is 89 overall left guard for the Cowboys, Ronald Leary, who gives plus 9 to both long pass and speed run chemistries. Not the greatest card and an 89 overall lineman at this point in the game is less than to be desired. Uh, but he's got 69 speed and 78 acceleration to get out in front of those uh, screens. 90 strength uh, along with a very, very poor 76 stamina. He's got run blocking and pass blocking strength at 94 and 93 and then drops down significantly for run block and pass block footwork at 85 and 82 with a decent impact blocking at 84 so all in all not not a card that I would be interested in using next is 88 overall D tackle for the Patriots Tommy Kelly uh, who only played in five games for the Patriots but had a decent uh, decent uh, decent five games he gets plus 10 to run stuff and plus 9 to zone defense chemistries he's got 72 speed coupled with 80 acceleration a very good 94 strength and once again not the greatest stamina at 83 the main stats though are his defensive stats he's got 82 tackle and 82 hip power a good 87 power move and a great block shedding at 93 76 pursuit and 78 play rec a card that is more viable to use than Ronald Leary but still not a card that most people have a use for on their team at this point in the game next is 93 overall wide receiver for the Dolphins Brian Hartline uh, he gives plus 8 to ground and pound and plus 11 to short pass chemistry a card more viable for teams but still not a card interested by most He's got a very bad 91 speed, 92 agility, 92 acceleration, 90 awareness, and a good 96 catching. Uh, 87 jumping is not the greatest, but the 96 catching is. 90 stamina is pretty good. He's got 84 elusiveness, 76 ball carry, 83 spin, and 85 juke. Good moves. Uh, and then really good 95 route running and 96 catching traffic, but a poor 88 spec catch and 88 release making him a, a decent option for some people next is Jimmy Smith a 91 overall cornerback for the Ravens he gives plus 9 to Mandy and plus 9 to pass rush chemistries um, a low overall but a viable option for Ravens fans or looking for looking somebody looking to test out a new corner he's got 93 speed with 92 acceleration 93 agility 90 jumping so he can get up there and intercept some balls 89 stamina uh, 71 tackle, which isn't terrible for a cornerback. 72 hit power, also not terrible for a cornerback. 72 block shedding, 74 pursuit, 84 play rec, not awful. A great 95 man, 87 zone, 90 press. So all in all, a card that is worth at least testing out. And finally, the final addition, John Beeson, 96 overall middle linebacker for the New York Giants. He gives plus 10 to run stuff and plus 9 to pass rush chemistries. And uh, this is the card that you may want to use. He's got 89 speed, 87 strength, 92 agility, 94 acceleration, 92 awareness, a good 77 catching, 86 jumping, and a great 94 stamina. A poor injury though, so I keep an eye on that. He's got 76 elusiveness, 95 tackle with a 90 hip power. He's got a poor power move, but a decent finesse at 78. 89 block shedding, a great 94 pursuit coupled with a great 90, 96 play rec. Also can play a little man and also a little zone, but just make sure not to press him. Uh, so that is the new final edition cards. Um, some very viable options with some very poor options, but still things that maybe you could test out on your team. Um, just to see if they're good or not. And also the John Beeson, definitely worth trying. But that's going to do it for this episode. Um, my Man Ultimate Team series. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop it a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. You guys know the deal. And I will catch you guys all in my next video. Peace out, guys.